In the last video we built this simple example, but we can actually polish this up, even though this is very crude. One thing that we can do is that we don't need this view. You need to have at least one in order to create the first entry, but since we are using it here, I'm pretty sure we don't need this one. So we can actually go here and delete the item. And the, this is more like what we want. We can even, we don't need multiple entries in here. One uh, should be enough. So we can actually go here and put maximum item. Well, that's the, if we limit the result to one, I believe that that's gonna uh, work. Let's see. Let's click this save. And you know, this is a little better. So we have the name of the reference set and only one entry in here. Now, one thing that we would like to do is that if, if you have been following this series, you probably went to my public box link, which is in the video description of all my videos. So you click on that link and you are taken into the box link where you find the PDF where I keep all the I mean, just not too many people know about it. In the second page, I have a file that many people have considered very useful, where there is a link, links and searches of all the hundreds of videos that we have done here for Curator. So, but uh, what I want to show you in here is that in the when you first go there, there is a poll dashboards. So, and in here, these are the two that I that are part of this uh, video series that we imported. But I also want to show you that in here, there are some Office 365 that Sophia created. And in here, there are some uh, Q&I uh, uh, dashboard for flows that uh, Dale created. And the reason I'm showing you this is I would like to kindly invite you to share your searches as you lo learn about this. I'm sure that you, you can create great dashboard if you want to share the share them with the community uh, please put a comment in the video description and i'll figure out a way for us to get together so i can download uh, i can upload your json file and make it available to other people and your name will be here you will be completely credited with your dashboard in fact you can even put your name in the description when you create this but the idea is to uh, share the instead of having people do the same thing let's put this as a center of community there are thousands of curator customers and, uh, and and quite a few of uh, curator practitioners so again if you want to share something with the rest of the community simply drop me a, a comment in the video description and then uh, we can go to, uh, you know figure out a way of actually communicating with one another directly and share your creation with the rest of the community.